Hey guys, this is Toy Hunter Tony here with episode 252 of this week's Top 10 Hot Comic Books found out in a while and or my beautiful collection. Hey Nikki, how are you doing? He wants to remind me that we actually got these out of Alipax. This week's Top 10 is going to be featured from the On the Hunt uh, 124 if you want to see the un uh, reveal of those Ollie packs. I think we got three packs. So we'll have some honorable mentions here at the end also. But um, I want to do some shout outs. We haven't seen you in a while. Welcome back. That's, I don't want to get a song strike because you know I sing so well. But I got to do some huge shout outs before we get going. Uh, uh, JYDY, hey buddy, how are you doing? I commented on episode 30. Holy crap, you went in the way back time machine. That's almost 222 episodes ago. That's quick math right there. I'm a mather. Yeah, shut up, Nikki. Uh, anyways, uh, that was a uh, top 10 featuring books from a Walmart packs and a couple other things. I can't remember it so long ago, but uh, thanks for the shout out. He said, uh, I love Lady Deadpool. Uh, that is awesome art and that is a great story. Uh, that is a, it's still got some value to it too. So I'm excited. Thanks for the comment. And then I got Mr. Jommies. I love Hot Wheels. Yes, that's in reference to episode 123 on the hunt where my big brother sent me a care package of some random Hot Wheel goodness. They are right over there. And we did modify our rack so we will be able to handle uh, Hot Wheels in the next upcoming two or three videos. We'll feature those Hot Wheels packs, uh, Mr. Jami. And then um, we also, because I think our last On the Hunt video, we did a pack reveal. Oof, oof, that was a lot on my forehead. Nikki made so much fun of me. We modified our uh, single camera uh, to modify it so we can do a better pack reveal and also see our books better and I can handle them better. You shall see them here in the next uh, few minutes. And then the uh, last not shout out is uh, a Pantera. I uh, said, uh, I bought 10 copies of Hulk number six uh, 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 after you were hyping him up. I digress. Uh, Pantera, this video is going to feature Hulk issue six, which is the first appearance of uh, Titan. That is the Hulk's Hulk. And the Smashtronauts series was leading up to this point, And I bought into it because it's ultimate, ultimate being. And uh, Mr. Donny Cates had issues and had to stop, uh, just left it right in the middle of writing it. Didn't get to finish it the way they wanted to. I know Ryan Otley picked up the outlines from Donny Cates to finish the story, but they also said they were gonna use him in a future, future storyline. So hopefully, keep our fingers crossed that that book goes up, you know, cause you invested 10 number ones. <clears throat> I've made, I may have um, uh, bought 80 A's uh, what did I say? 15 B's, 5 C's, 4 1 and 25's, uh, 2 1 and 50's, and 1 and 100. I had to get that. That was the first cover appearance of Titan. Um, I, I still believe we'll, we'll reap the rewards of that someday. <sighs> Keep our fingers crossed. All right, so I hate guys who hype it up and don't know what the hell they're talking about. Nicholas. All right, that's it. Shout outs. All right, we're going to get to the, this week's top 10. Uh, look at that Deadpool shirt. I did get that here recently. Please tell me you've gone and participated in that billion dollar movie. Did you know that it's over $600 million? Uh, is it past? It's past some other records. I don't have it in front of me. Nikki said just keep moving on, but I can't believe it. I, I can't wait to see it. A second time. My boys have seen it twice and they can't wait to come, for it to come out so they can watch it a third time. <laughs> you ready to go? Number 10 of this week's top 10 is none other than, check it out. Look at that. Look at that. That is beautiful. This is Night Mask, issue number seven. This is from the new universe. This is Marvel's uh, alternate universe with different heroes and different stories. And uh, believe it or not, this universe is actually responsible for Star Brand. Uh, Night Mask was pretty cool. This is a newsstand. Uh, this one goes between three and seven dollars, and it's a solid get at four dollars. Let's put that up on the big wall. Let's see how we're doing this, and see if I can get this right. Nice. <laughs> Sorry, Nick. Hey, clean up your stuff, bud. Almost knocked over your coffee. <laughs> can we see that? 
Yeah, that don't look too bad. So we got a little saturation issue. If I'm not in the picture, it looks white. That is so weird. That's been doing that as long as we've been here. Are you, you ready? Number two? Uh, I'm looking up at the wall. I put that in number five. <laughs> there you go. I can hear my mom yelling at me in the background. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. Don't worry. Number 10. I think he just giggles. All right. Number eight of this week's top 10 is none other than Legion Lost number one, volume two. This is 2011, the new 52 run. Uh, this one goes between three and five bucks, and that's a solid get at four. You know, I did not get that book when it first came out. Uh, I hadn't read it, but um, I didn't buy all the new 52s, but it's cool. It's the number one. It's number nine of this week. <clears throat> Can't wait for the James Gunn cinematic universe to come out. Can't wait. So number eight, number eight is dun 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 dry roll try roll. Oh, got it. Look at that. That is Batman number forty-seven. This is volume three. This is the reboot after the new fifty-two. Uh, this is the twenty eighteen. Three to five dollars. It's a solid get at four. Now I have been still getting Batman the whole time we've gone through all these reboots and I was tickled pink to find out that um, they're going to use the Court of Owls in an upcoming story. Can't wait to see them in the movies. Hello. So we got to get to it. So we're not, we're nowhere near the halfway point. I modified our, our Segway cameras. So I know I did not say, hey, 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 you can always reach us here at Toy Hunter Tony on YouTube at, or on Instagram at Toy underscore Hunter underscore Tony and then Facebook at Toy Hunters Club. And then you can uh, always contact, I'm getting lightning in here, Nick, or is it uh, my, con my connection? Uh, it's weird, it lights flashing. Hopefully it's not showing up in the recording. <laughs> you can always contact us at Toy Hunter Tony at yahoo.com and that's also uh, our payment through PayPal. All right, cool. That is our halfway thing. And I did it at number seven. So number seven is, there we go. I'll get the buttons right eventually. Look at that. That is Cable, issue number 18. This is from 1984. Believe it or not, that was a year. Is it 84 or 94, Nick? 94. Okay, that is not the year I graduated. That was 10 years later. Uh, that was one year before you were born. Why would you... Your handwriting is atrocious, son. Uh, this has got Domino, Storm, and Caliban. I know that looked like Dragon Man there in the background, but that's actually Caliban. And uh, if you did not watch Logan, and you'll know who Caliban is in the story in the comic books. But that is uh, 3 to $5 also. So far, no bangers. Mostly close, just a little over cover price. But there's some value to these books. Number six of this week. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to have to figure out how to do this on the fly. This is Wolverine and the X-Men. This is from 2011. This is issue number 28. This one goes between 3 and 7. And it is a solid get at 5. Or Nikki likes to say, fair market value. Uh-oh. Hey, Pantera, you ready? <laughs> Guess what's coming up next? <laughs> That's at number 6. So this is Nick's pick. Oh, you dirty bird. So Nick picked this one out. Because, there he is, that is the first appearance of Titan, that's the Hulk Hulk. Alright, uh, obviously a cover A right now goes between 4 and $6, and it's a solid pickup at 5 At least we didn't lose money from cover price, Nick. Let's put that up on the big wall. Yeah, Nick, Nick wanted me to go through that whole story, uh, Pantera, but, you know, since you, you beat me, you beat him to it. <laughs> Who's going to hold me accountable for it? All right, cool. That is our top six. Hey, guys, as you know, this each one of my episodes is a claim sale. All these items are up for sale. All you got to do is type claim down in the comments. You get 10% off any of these books. All you got to do is type claim down in the comments. It's been a while. I haven't done this in a while. Stick around to the end of the video and find out how you can save 25% off all these books. <laughs> I remember that part. You ready? That, that's it, Nick. I already went through when I was at seven. He's telling me, yeah. Will you stop playing your Marvel Snap? Have you guys joined alliances yet? Uh, it's 30, 30 people per team. I think we are 
Do, can I announce it? We're two four seven twenty four seven. Uh, you don't know. You, he doesn't want me to tell you. He doesn't want that influx of all the people wanting to join. And plus, Michael, Michael, if you're listening to me, stop kicking people who do not have a thousand points when uh, before the season's done. That is very wrong. <laughs> Check out Marvel Snap. I'll, I'll give you the information down in the comments. Maybe you can find an opening in our squad. All right, you ready? Halfway point is over. Let's go back to it. Uh, number five. The, guys, this is Silver Star. This is a Pacific Comics uh, cover. <laughs> I was going to say cover. It's a book, comic book uh, from 1983. Uh, this is uh, Jack Kirby artwork. Uh, issue three is worth between four and five bucks and solid get at five. Let's put that up on the big wall. So then, now we're getting to the good stuff, right, Nick? I like Jack Kirby's art. Always have. I used to, I had all uh, Gru. Didn't Gru come from Pacific Comics, Nicky? I love, I love Sergio Aragon's Gru. Something random you don't normally see. Number four this week is none other than... Uh, Tribe number one. This is from Image, 1993. Uh, Johnson and Stro Strowman. This was one of those big books, you know, when Image first came out. These were everywhere. I remember this selling between uh, 15 and 25 dollars. But there's there's millions of them. It is a great read. I love the artwork. And for five bucks, fair market value, three to seven dollars on average. Uh, this is a good. A good book to pick up. I'll put that up on the wall. Yeah, plus it was a foil embossed cover. It was one of those things to catch your eye. Yeah, it, it, it got a little, uh, um, a lot of issues produced. That is for sure. I think that's why Ollie's, whoever's packaging these books will have hundreds of these. Number three of this week, check that out. That is another shiny cover. Uh, this is Excalibur number 75. It's a holo foil. Uh, this is the first appearance of Day Tripper. Uh, four to eight dollars on average. Uh, fair market value six big ones. Uh, I'm gonna just I'm gonna doing it the wrong way, Nikki. I don't I have to get used to the new setup. It looks better though. I have to admit. I, I want to thank uh, Nick and Michael for working with me, trying to get the camera situated. Uh, if you did not know, these cameras that we're using, if they get past a certain point, they want to go from horizontal to vertical, and that was a pain in the butt. It took us a couple days to figure it out and how we were going to present these books to you. Number two is none other than, uh, that is not a lighting issue. That is Kyle Rainier. Uh, this is Guardians, New Guardians, Green Lantern. By Tyler Kirk, Kirkham. Kirkham, New 52, number one, four to eight bucks. Solid get at six. Put that up on the wall. Yeah, they made a big announcement for a Green Arrow. A Green Arrow, geez Louise. A green Lantern. We'll be seeing that uh, hopefully on Max as a series. Don't know yet, but like I said, as we get more information, we will share it with you. That's number two, number one of this week. Look at that. This is Princess Leia, Star Wars. Uh, this is a beautiful uh, Terry Dodson cover. It's actually cover A. This one goes between $5 and $10, and it's a solid get at $10. Uh, 10 bucks. Jeez Louise, $7. Nikki, I can't look. I'm looking at different things now. This um, it's beautiful. I love that artwork. Number one. All right, that camera, if you remember... I used to have this. <laughs> I love this diorama. And we would sit the book in here. But then I would have to reach over the top and I would knock it over and change it every single time. And I couldn't do pack reveals with this. So I don't know quite what I'm going to do with that. I'll give that to you, Nick. Can you sit that over there for me? Thank you. And then um, we'll get to it. Our bonus of this week is none other than, drum roll please, Turok. Uh, this is another one of those, a, a 1993. So, believe it or not, Valiant was producing this uh, gold chromium cover. Uh, this this is just, I loved Valiant. I bought into Valiant. I, I still support Valiant. 
but I think they lost Turok uh, in, in um, what is that when you, an IP, right? I don't know which camera I'm going at. <laughs> Let me put that up on the big wall. I thought maybe we'd see a movie, but I guess since um, Bloodshot didn't do very well, they kind of let the rights uh, lapse back to the original owners. And still good read, still good cover. Love it. Let me take a look at them. All right, remember all 12 of these books, Nick. What, the, <laughs> what are they? These This week's hunt total. There we go. I got distracted. Nikki's making faces. Uh, this whole, whole hunt. Goodness gracious. All 12 books. 59 big ones. Yay! Remember, all you got to do is type claim down in the comments. You automatically get 10% off. All you got to do is uh, follow us on either channel here on Instagram, here on YouTube or Instagram or on Facebook. And you can save 25% off. How? By being a big game hunter, right? And that's somebody who buys all 12 of these issues. You can get them for uh, $44. Yep, that's not bad. And, uh, oh, Nikki wanted me to, to show you real quick. So we've got, these are the extra ones that did not make the top 10. You got Lumber Jeans, issue number three. That is a $3 book on average. Uh, there's an Exo Man of War issue number 15. Uh, that is also in there. And then uh, a Silver Bait, a Gene Colon. That is a, I actually enjoyed that book. Uh, that is a vampire type thing. You know how Gene Colon loves vampires. All right, let's go back to the big wall. All three of those books will be included free if you buy all 12. All right, we got it here, Nick. Man, it feels good to be in here. Temperature's like 75 degrees. It's nice and cool. Nice rack system. Nice setup. High five. Nice. Are you going to smack me or something? You just let me hang it. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, we will see you soon on the next hunt. What do you say, Nikki? See ya.